All right, Aries, let's get on with part two. Let's get into the beef of the matter, shall we? All right, so some of the angel cards that came out was grief, okay? Some of you might be dealing with some grief right now or some may be coming to you. You need to look for synchronicities, okay? I have a feeling a bunch of you are getting them and you're ignoring them, okay? It might be freaking you out. But don't ignore them. There's a reason for it. That's your angels, your guides. They're talking to you. That's why they throw you synchronicities, to get you on board with them, okay? So the green fairy. A cheeky green fairy on your behalf is appearing here to make you laugh, okay? Practice. After a while, you'll dance on air. Practice, practice makes perfect. You're almost there. So some of you may be working on a project that you haven't quite launched yet or uh, got off the ground. So wishing well to make some wish, wish magic, cast this spell through pennies into the wishing well. Spirit just told me to be careful what you wish for. Okay. I don't know. Some of you been maybe making wishes and now you regret the wish you made. I don't know. All right. <clears throat> All right, so I brought out the special angels for you guys, and I know I didn't look at them and see what they are. I, I don't want to touch for a minute. I want to get the what's going on here. Okay, so let's talk about the stones that you guys are gonna. So they're they're called Herkimer diamonds. Um, oh, I don't have one. Anyways, they're tiny. Um, they they're really not this big. If you find one this big, it's gonna be super expensive. They're they're like. Let me see if I can. Most places they have them. I'm trying to find. Oh, this would be about the size. So, like this. They're literally like about that size. They're usually skinnier, but they're tiny and they're expensive. Total, they're expensive for what they are. But they help you with your dreams. Um, they help your dreams be more vivid, more accurate. Um, and they also, if you have those like on your bed stand in like a little cup, it will help um, protect your dreams too. Okay? So, Herkimer. Okay? Um, you can get these at Lotus. Um, Austin has them in a glass cabinet. When you walk in the door, he has glass cabinets. They're in there, the Herkimers. He has them in a cup. Okay. Hidden Knight. This is all about gratitude. I do not have a piece of this, but I definitely want to get one. So, just some Hidden Knight and work on gratitude. Spirit says, start journaling. Start writing down every day what you're grateful for. Okay? What you want to release and what you want to change and what you want to become. Don't use the word need. Okay? Do not use the word need when you're manifesting. It doesn't work. When you use the word need, mm, not good. That's demanding of spirit to give you something. We don't do that. Okay, I can't ever say this one. This is about new beginnings, and I don't have one of these, but I'm going to get me one. Look at that. Isn't that cool? So some of you got new beginnings on the way. Calcite, relaxation. Oh, I love calcite. So I've got some Utah calcite, which is really cool. Let me go grab it. I want to show it to you guys because um, this helps you relax. I have it on the side of my bed. I love calcite. Oh. Okay, calcite's amazing. This piece I have, it fits in my hand, perfect. Um, this one is, it's, it's mined here in Utah. They call it honeycomb too. Um, and Austin has this at Lotus too. He's got it in chunks and baskets in the back. See how that fits in my hand like that? Look at that, isn't that cool? Beautiful. The minute I touch this and I hold this like this and I'll put it, Oh, it's like my heart or something. You immediately, I can feel it. I get centered. I just, it's a cool, cool feeling. Anyways, pick you guys up some of this. It will, it, it will help you out. Okay. All right. There, you can also go to um, Dave's Health and Wellness. Dave is branching out like crazy. His store 
over off 39th and 7th, I mean 9th East. Um, that's his big, his Sandy store doesn't have as much um, as far as crystals and things go. But he has, right now he has so many amazing things. Oh my gosh. And he has a guy over that works there. I keep forgetting his name. He's so cute. He's a, he's a kid. I just love him. We pick each other's brains. I go in there and I can, I can go stay in there forever and ever. Um, but it's an amazing, amazing place. Um, there's the, the dancing crane. There's the Indian trading post on Roaded Road, and that's about between 40th and 21st. It's the Indian trading post on the east side of the road. And then in, in his little complex there, he has a partner that has just a crystal shop there that's got amazing stuff. Um, and I said Lotus. Um, anyways, there's lots more, but those are the ones that I frequent and go to the, the most um, that I find my, my stuff at. So, anyways... Just to help you out if you're looking for stuff. Um, I don't like to order crystals. And if Sometimes I'll order a few things here and there online. Because I, I like to resonate with it. And I like to touch it and feel it. When you pick it up, if you don't get a feeling from it, that's not right for you. You know? So look at this. I'm going to show you guys this. Isn't that cool? It's rainbow quartz. Yeah. My cousin's daughter came down from school from Logan. And we had a, she came and stayed with me. And we went crystal shopping. Anyways, she bought this for me. Because Maddie is my sweetheart. Isn't that beautiful? Anyways, you just... Oh, the feeling when you get when you touch this. It's amazing, too. So, anyway. Oh, yeah. And... Oh, I don't have it. So, in the next video, I'll probably show it. Um, but I bought when we were at the... Um, oh, when we were also at the Centered Stone. I got a um, Lemurian Seed Crystal. And I'm obsessed with, with Lemurian crystals because um, I'm Greek. So, um, But I have this just fascination with that time period and everything. But anyways, Austin gets those in. Um, Dave is starting to get a few in. But his selection is nothing like Lotus. Nothing like what Austin has at Lotus. Um, and so when Atlantis went down and sunk... And they have the explosion and all that. You remember, that whole city was powered by crystals. The people talked through crystals. Everything, even their weapons were crystals. Everything that they did was their, it was, um, their vehicles. Or everything was powered by crystals. And, um, so anyways, all of these Lemurian crystals are still embedded down in, the ocean and there's certain people that are allowed to mine them and go down and get them and they're all the way from the coast of um spain turkey greece all the way down to the boot you know of italy so um but he has a hard time getting them now he used to have tons of them um the, you can find white ones a lot easier than you can find dark ones i only have a couple of um dark ones um and my oldest son I mean, my youngest son, he has this, he, I, I have this, had bought this big giant one and brought it home and it's, it's almost, it's dark, dark brown, almost black. And he, man, he scooped that thing right up. That one's mine, mom. <laughs> but he can hold this in his hand and he's such a powerful spiritual being that it goes white. His power, is, he, he's such an amazing person. Um, it goes white. So he's my he's my calm child that has beautiful energy that you feel and then my oldest son is more powerful than he knows and he has super strong energy it's almost scary at times you definitely don't want to mess with him and any kind of a spiritual battle you'll lose you both my boys you will never ever ever touch them they were born this way and they were brought up by me and my kids know how to protect themselves and they know how to fight spiritually so if you ever, if anybody ever sends them stuff, you're going to be sorely mistaken because who watches over them is my dad. Yeah. And they all have an army above them and my kids know how to connect. They always have. And, um, <clears throat> so if you even try to infiltrate their energy or their space, you're going to be one sorry son of a bitch. Yes, you will. And whatever you will towards them, you better be careful. You better be careful. Yes, you better. A lot of people have tried and um, hasn't worked out so well. So, 
Don't be one of those stupid people. That's all I gotta say. Cause I got a, I got an army of people, gang stalking, stealing all my stuff, and lying, conniving, doing all kinds of crap to me and my family. It, it, it's not gonna work. So, I'm not afraid of any of you. Come after me and see what happens. I dare you. Had enough. They're all a bunch of losers. Low life bottom feeders, sewer maidens, and street rats. So, just so you know, I know who you are. I know what you're doing. And I'm going to expose every one of you. So keep coming for me. Keep doing what you're doing. And I'm going to expose you. I got all your names and my decks over here. Yes, I do. And they're going to come out. So you'll never know what I know. And see, the thing is about you low vibing idiots is uh, you guys gang stalk people like us that are out to do good. You spend more time gang stalking us wielding weak ass spells working in the dark hiring people to do crap to us and it doesn't do any damn good um you'll sit and watch us all day long all night long and still our stuff and do nothing but talk shit about behind us uh, behind our backs but yet you focus and put all this time into us so help me to understand this you supposedly don't believe in anything we can do we're losers we don't walk in our truth. We don't have spiritual gifts. We don't know what our, we're talking about, but you put all this effort into us. So help me to understand who's the sick son of a bitch here. Hmm? Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty clear. Pretty clear. Pretty damn clear. So I just wanted to put that out there because it, it just doesn't add up. It doesn't add up. I got a whole crew of people out there talking crazy stuff on me and I just laugh I think it's funny I really do because everybody that knows me knows who I am what I am and um, I'm definitely um, the the rumors and the stories make me laugh so keep it up because the only person that looks like the idiot here is you people you're the ones that look jealous you're the ones that look envious and you're the ones that look mentally crazy and unstable not us Okay, so um, you guys are also the ones that are creating spiritual practices to steal people's money and con them. Okay, well, you can't say I'm doing that because if you look on my channel, I don't even ask for donations. I don't put anything up there where you can give me one. I'll make my own my own way. Okay, and when I get monetized, then that's a whole nother thing. But until then, I put my time in. And so how dare any of you talk any kinds of crap on any of us that have channels okay we study we put in our time i am the furthest thing from lazy and everyone that knows me knows that i work a full-time job that i've had for the last four years and i'm very good at what i do and then i put an extra 20 to 30 hours with my daughter into this channel so let's see here hmm who's the desperate pathetic one okay i'm gonna get off that now it's really pissed me off and a bunch of other people that have channels. We are all so sick of you people, okay? Because you've turned spirituality into a joke, those of you, okay? Half of you are human trafficking people with, with um, spirituality, and I'm going to expose you to. Half of you are just fake and false, and you can channel anything to save your damn life, and you don't have one intuitive instinct in your body, spirit, or mind. You're out to screw people over. Half of you are so damn karmic that the only thing that you do is play in the dark. Okay? The weak play in the dark and the weak run in packs. You never saw an ascended master or a god or goddess that had to have their little cronies or their little following or their groupies to do their work. No. They work alone. I work alone. Always have. Always will. Not interested in a partner, never will be. Not that dumb, okay? Um, so those of you that little play in your little stupid cults, your little secret societies, get into your little weekend groups where you guys think you're all badass and that, and do your little seances and all that stuff, you're losers, man. You're total, total losers. And you're gonna be exposed. We're gonna get rid of you people because we don't need you here. 
okay? We're here to wield light. We're here to wield happiness. We are here to expose because a lot of us have been, you can't become the this a spiritual person unless you go through some tragedy, trauma, and um, go through some real hard times. And most of the people that are the most gifted, their families have walked off from them. They've sold them under. They've turned a blind eye to them or they act embarrassed of them or they start smear campaigns and start talking shit about them. I know how this feels exactly. Um, you've lost everything and you had to start over. And that's what makes you strong. And you will eventually, when you've had enough, you'll you'll get you'll get up and you'll be like a tower a tower's coming cool bring that bitch on i can take it yeah that's exactly how you start acting um you won't be afraid i'm not afraid i used to be because these people did so much black magic and did so much shit to me behind my back that it it can it and i wasn't i didn't i wasn't aware of what was happening to me till i found out then I researched into it and I dove into it because I never understood the dark arts or the black magic because I've never had an interest in it, nor would I. And I've never gone there and I never will. So then I had to go down that rabbit hole and study it and learn about it to fight back at these damn assholes that were doing this to me and my family. And those of you that think this is a joke and you don't think it's real, well, just wait till it happens to you. It's more real than anyone knows. And thank God now that we do have YouTube um, and there we have our channel so that we can expose these people. Because in the past, they've gotten away with this and then people thought people are nuts and crazy and they don't know what they're talking about. But this is like any subject matter. When people have no idea what you're talking about, it sounds crazy to them, then they'll they'll label it crazy. Because, frankly, um, they're not awakened to understand this, and maybe they're, this, this, they don't have the substance in their, their soul to understand it. And some people, it's not their thing, and that's okay. I mean, it's no big deal. I don't go around when I'm in public saying, I'm this, I'm that, I can do this, I can do that. I rarely, I don't offer my services to people. Um, if you're somebody I know personally, that's different. But people I don't know, I don't do that. But I always laugh because they, whenever I go out and about, there's always that one person that wants everybody to know that she's a badass and she's, she can hurt you, she can harm you, she can wield against you and she can heal you at the same time. Um, I used to have a friend. We couldn't go anywhere, and uh, I mean, she's blocked and out of my life for good. I mean, she's 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 a nobody, but uh, she used to be so embarrassing because we'd go places and she'd have to tell everybody, "Oh, I'm a shaman. I'm a witch. I can do this. Too. I can stand a broom up. I can go in a car accident. I I levitated the car in the air before it hit me. Like how the hell, when you're in the middle of a giant bad car accident, did you all of a sudden?" Levit the car that's coming to hit you, you stopped it by your energy. I mean, get real. This stuff is so ridiculous. So ridiculous. But anyways, um, there are people out there like that. I always sh just laugh and walk away. And, and I don't, I just don't deal with it. But just so you know, go back to the Matrix, you guys. <clears throat> Think about the Oracle in the Matrix. She didn't live in any giant village or castle or cool house or anything she was hidden and there was a reason she was hitting hidden because she was so powerful and she had knowledge that nobody could tap into they hid her for a specific reason and only special people were allowed to talk to her and get to her and were allowed to i, I don't want to say um experience her services but maybe that's the right yeah experience her services or gain her knowledge so just remember that those of you that you run in your stupid little groups and your little cults and your covens and your secret societies, you're losers. Let me say it again. Capital L, capital O, capital S, capital E, capital R. And another S. Losers. Okay? You guys annoy the hell out of me because I've had so many of you harm and hurt me. And I'm sick of it. And I'm going to make sure. Trust me. You guys keep it up. Your last names are going to start coming up. I got first names, but I will start doing last names. That'll get the cops faster at your asses too, won't it? All right, arrows. Direction is yours to choose today. Your inner light will guide the way. Okay? So some of you have a decision. You might be at a crossroads. 
bunch of you are watching are wanting validation all right validation's bullshit people give it to yourself if you're seeking validation you're insecure and you're in your south node and you are definitely not in your north node so you don't need validation get it from yourself if you need to seek it from other people so bad then there's something that you need to go back and work on all right that just means you're extremely codependent and insecure all right so let's get to the beef of this story shall we because we're already 20 minutes into me rambling all right i'm sorry i'm super passionate about this guys if you don't understand too bad if you'd experienced and been through what i've been through you'd understand all the people that have gone through what i'm going through and they have channels they're talking about all this stuff too they get excited and they are just as passionate as i am about this i can't stand seeing kids hurt i can't stand seeing people that are out here to do good and they get hurt by losers that these people don't have jobs they don't take care of their kids they're not good to their own family they're horrible to their friends they're just they're not good people and i'm sick of it i'm sick of it and then they run around and they harm and hurt other people and they create giant lies and they 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 they, they, they con they scheme they do fraud they hurt people they go as they, i mean we're talking pedophilia we're talking murder okay guys i mean this is serious ass shit. and i need you people to wake the hell up with me and everyone else those of you that chose choose to be in the dark you're going to get a lesson and spirit's going to wake you up because if we don't get on board and you don't notice on what's going on around the world you're going to get an experience too all right so i pulled star seed cards i pulled um light worker cards and soul cards Oh, we got, here's another one that I forgot about. Okay, the fire agate. Oh, this is beautiful. And I don't have one of these either, and I want to get one. But this helps with creativity, okay? So see if you guys can find one of these, all right? So you got a lot of good crystals that you guys can go get to help you out with what's going on. All right, let's work through before we get the basis here. <clears throat> all right, star seat cards. Number 33, this is a master number, journey to wholeness, okay? Somebody's on their awakening. Sacral chakra, the blockages. Now, be careful, guys, because some of you are running around doing you know what with several people. Don't share your sexual energy. That's your creative energy. That's your womb. It's special. You don't just go give that away. Remember, guys, who you're sleeping with and sleeping around with, if they're out sleeping around, and then they come sleep back with you. They're attaching those skanky ass energies to you. Spirit says, knock it off. I don't know who who's out there whoring themselves out, but you better knock it off. You're being made fun of, just so you know. All right, home. This is about your way home to the lost lands, to your universe to the star planet you came from this is feeling at home with it okay so these are your past ancestors star seeds reclaim your energy all right this is why this came up this person is feeding off you sexually okay they're harvesting off your energy you're an empath aries i don't know who i'm talking to here but one of you is giving away your power and your energy to another male energy, I'm being told. He's an incubus succubus, okay? He is contaminating your soul and your spirit, and he has an STD, I'm being told. God, I'm so sick of these STDs and these friggin' whores and these gigolos and these escorts and prostitutes and ugh filthy energy i can feel it right there you're a filthy person whoever you are all right hyreth longing for home homesick for the stars what did i just say i just said reclaiming your energy and home and wholeness okay see those those are beautiful home back to your home 
where you came from. This is past life energy, guys. Okay. Earth pulsing. Pulse of Mother Earth. Slow down. Time in nature. Okay. You need to go lay down on the grass or go lay down in the dirt. I can't, I always have to have my um, shoes off when I walk in the grass. I love to get my feet down in the earth. That's part of the reason why I have such ugly hands because I worked at a nursery for eight years. Besides, that's my nervous thing is I bite my nails till they bleed. I have man hands, I know. But I have my father's hands and I love that. So I don't really care what anybody says. Um, but I've always worked with my hands. These hands have, have, have done a lot of hard, hard labor. But I love to get my hands in the dirt. And I love to have my feet in the dirt. I like to, I'll lay in the damn dirt. I'm a total dirt monger. Anyways, this is how you, we call it earthing. You need to get earthing, okay? This, you, you get out earthing, you're going to disconnect from this toxic, low vibing energy that's attached to you because whoever you're having sex with, they're pulling you into your south node. They're contaminating you. They're confusing you, okay? And they're just harvesting off you. They are using you. We're going to find out who this is, but they are using you, okay? Forge, don't follow. Pave a new path. Be the leader you wish you had. All right. Um, the last, it's either Leo or Sag had this too, or maybe both. So, forge forward, not backwards. A new earth, okay? It's happening. Keep holding the vision. Okay, you guys are part of, ooh, I just got whoa spirit just came over me Woo! i get the cold chills you eight are a part of this new earth the new plan ushering it in helping people so you got to get through this awakening so you can get to a point where you can be a helper okay right now you're not you're too busy trying to take care of a wounded warrior a wounded soul Someone that doesn't really want the help. They just want to suck off you and beat your ass down. This I, I can feel this person's mentally abusive. I don't know who it is, but they're mentally abusive. Guardian of the soul family, okay? So this is your an ancient ancestors up there. And they're guarding you. They're over you. This is a past loved one that's trying to protect you and get you to wake the hell up. I just heard ding dong. Oh, I don't know acceptance okay this is from up above it's a master number this is you leveling up and accepting it this is on the 5d this is not the 3d people there is someone that is trying so bad to communicate and you are not listening eruption of light this is what they're sending next Look up the number 55, please. The number 26. Eruption of light. This is twin flame energy. This is new beginnings. This is you are a light worker. Some I just heard I'm refusing. So I don't know what that means. Okay. So now you have the you have um <clears throat> the angels here of unity and charity. Okay, you're supposed to be working on spiritual service when this card comes up. This is helping others. Okay? And the unity coming, that's this. When people see this card, they think it's unity, like coming into union with somebody. No. This is unity with yourself. Your personal journey. Okay? <coughs> All right see what else we got going on man there's some heavy energy here i can already feel i don't like it Alright guys, that's better. 
can't stand that hard energy. Somebody wants to come in and annoy me. You got somebody that's annoying you, Aries. Somebody that is really putting you in a bad mood lately. I can feel this person's like a bully. They got bully energy. All right. I'm going to save these for... All right. They got somebody juggling, okay? Someone's juggling. Yeah, somebody's holding on tight to their money behind your back, I was just told. Okay? They're telling you they don't have money. They're a liar. They do. Okay? Giving to two. And you're giving to them is what I was just told. Oh, oh next card. Trickery. This is deceit. This is deception. Okay? This is a complete and total deception behind your back. This is fuckery on all time high. And you're not even paying attention. You are so busy in your emotions because this is where they have you. And this person is a professional at this. He's like a serial dater. I don't know why. Woo. Woo. Tower. Scorpio energy. So we got earth energy. And we have air energy here right now. And now we have water. Ooh, Knight of Wands. Hmm, this is player, player. And, he, and this is the worst. He's not even a king. He's such a... The, ugh. Spirit just said he's a complete maggot, a loser. I'm sorry. I just feel like this whole video, I've been rude and I'm not. It's a, this message has to get out. You need to pull your head out of your ass, sweetheart. Yeah. This is Leo. This is you guys. This is Leo Sag Aries Energy. I don't know yet if this is a teenager in your house or if this is this immature person that you're funding. I heard you're footing the bill. And he's laughing behind your back. He makes fun of you when you're not around. He goes in the bathroom and makes phone calls to other people. He's on several dating sites. I just heard wishy-washy. I heard not on top. I don't know what that. Ew. 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 All right, we're moving on. Queen of Swords, okay? Libra. Gemini and Aquarius energy here. All right. The Knight of Wands, this, this guy comes in like a knight. He's fast action. Comes in. This guy... He's too cheap to even bring you flowers, but he'd stop at seven, get one of those fake ones for you. Yep. And then he'll bring he'll bring the cheapest beer in the door with you. Cheapest alcohol. And so he had someone buy that for him and he'll bring it to your house and he'll act like he brought you a present. <laughs> he's gonna eat your food. While while you're in the shower, he's gonna raid your purse and wallet. Oh yeah. Yep. Yep. He's going to con you into buying him clothes, whatever he needs. You're going to do it. You are going to do it. So, I, I, this, <sighs> this person has a plan, and you're not a part of the end result. You're being used to piss somebody else off, I'm being told. You're being used to piss someone off. You're a pawn. In a very large pool. This Queen of Swords. Spirit just told me she knows what's going on. She's not stupid. She's very well aware what is hidden and not being seen. And she's laughing her ass off. So you might want to think about that. Because I'm being told this person is your friend. So why would you do that to your friend? Hmm. Ah. Trying to hide. This is either both of you trying to cloak yourselves and pretend you're not doing what you're doing, or this is him. King of Pentacles. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Mm -hmm. All right, let's find this out. Let's get on this. All right. Use my pendulum. All right, if you haven't watched me, when I bring this up, I get yes or no answers, okay? So I always started out asking a question. We know it's a yes question. 
and that direction the pendulum goes in is yes so then from then when it goes the other direction when i ask questions you know it's no okay all right let's clear this out spirit please spirit is my name stephanie vigas Thank you. Please clear out. Is this King of Pentacles the Knight of Wands? Ooh. Doesn't want to answer. Alright. Is this Knight of Wands a teenager? Wow. I've never had this happen. All right. It, oh, what are we doing here? All right, let's clear this out again. Is this Kina Wands a man? Okay. Because sometimes it can be a female in her masculine pentacles energy. Okay, so it's a man. Okay. All right, is this King of Pentacles in this Aries life currently? Yes. Okay. Is this King of Pentacles a con? Oh, yeah, big time. So he's here to use the Aries. Is that what you're telling me, Spirit? He's here to use the Aries? Yes. All right. Please clear out. So is this Knight of Wands like a teenage son to the Aries? Okay. He's trying to interfere. This son of a bitch right here. We're just going to call him a prick. I don't like his energy. I can feel it right now. He's trying to get into my head and my space. You can't do it, bitch. Ooh, I don't like him. Ooh, ooh, ooh he's a maggot. Wow, I have... I'm sorry. Woo! Wow. Look at him. Just look at this asshole. Yeah. Wow. So he's he's here to use you, Aries. Queen of Wands. This Queen of Swords knows. Oh, damn. Empress. That's why the Queen of Swords is out here. That's right. Yep. You guys are in trouble. Oh, ho, 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 ho. things are going to go down. For downtown Molly Brown. I don't even know where that came from, but whatever. Page of Pentacles. This is all this jackass has to offer is a page of Pentacles. This is nothing. <laughs> his spirit says he had to borrow the money. <laughs> it's not even his. He didn't have a job. Loser. So you got a king of cups here too. Okay. This is Scorpio Cancer Pisces energy. Oh, whoops. Uh, ooh, got a Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Okay. I don't know if this is you, Aries. That's Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. What's that? Let me look. Let's look. Let's look. What else do we got? This explains a whole lot. Yes, it does. Wow. Somebody's losing everything. All over stupid heartbreak. There was no love here. It's fake. This is about somebody using you to get back at someone else, and the person that they're get that they think they're getting back at, that person doesn't even care. Doesn't even care. That's how stupid this is. But you're getting used and hurt, and I'm being told they're involved in all kinds of other things, and you're now being watched right along with them, and you're harboring a fugitive. Wow. You're going to go down with this son of a bitch, sweetheart, and get him out of your house. You think people don't know he's at your house? They do. 
This queen, this empress, she knows everything. She's laughing. She's not saying anything, but she's laughing. She knows every time you're around her, you lie to her, you smile in her face. Your mask is falling off and cracking and she can see it and she can feel your energy and read and hear your thoughts. Plus, he's running around telling everybody about it behind your back, and he's laughing at you because he's saying you're such a dumb idiot, a dumb broad. He's using you to hurt her, and you're gullible enough to let him do it to you. And he's already got a back plan, and, and he's got, got several options, okay? Quit letting him use your car, too. Yeah. He's taking your car, and he's using it to make money in legal ways in your car. I'd get that car steam cleaned after all the friggin' ooh god, I just got an image. Ooh. Alright. Ugh. Somebody wants to send some messages out, okay? This could be through the internet. This could be texting. This is gossip though. I just said he was before I saw this card, he is talking about you behind your back, sweetheart. Pull your head out. I don't want you to get hurt, man. This is why I'm being like this. I don't want you to get hurt. God, I know what this feels like. That's why I'm... Ugh. Okay, secrets. Secrets. Emotions. This is Pisces energy. I also say, also say, say Scorpio and Cancer energy. Okay, I want, I want to know. I want to know. Is this Queen of Pentacles? Queen of Wands? Because this person is in reverse, and they're lo they're losing everything if they stay with this stupid maggot, the street rat they took in. Okay, is this Queen of Pentacles spirit? Is this the Queen of Wands? No. Okay, clear out. Thank you. So is this Queen of Pentacles? No, the Queen of Wands. Yes. Oh. Clear out, please. So, does the Queen of Wands know that he's screwing the Queen of Pentacles? No. Spirit just says, you think that you guys are all friends and you hang out together. Okay, well, that's good news, Queen of Wands. You're not the one losing everything. This Queen of Pentacles is, and this stupid King of Pentacles, he's going to lose it all, too. All right, why is this? I want to know, why is this? Why is this Queen of Cups here? Okay, choices. Oh, I heard it's his boyfriend. Oh, yuck. All right, sorry. It's his boyfriend. See all those options and choices? This is what he's out doing when you're at work, honey. And then when you come home from work and he goes, oh, I'm going out to work. I'm going to Uber. I'm going to do DoorDash. I'm going to go work my t-shirt business. I'm going to go do this. I'm going to go do that. No, he's on his back getting his dick sucked. Oh, gross. Yeah. Spirit stepping in here. This is Sagittarius energy. Con. Wow. Yeah. There's going to be a battle. It's coming. It's coming. Change. Yep. Money. I said bribery earlier. And, uh, yeah, somebody's losing everything. Everything. Huh. Someone paid him to do this to you. Heartbreak. Hmm. Stuck in the karmic wheel, going back to the south node, not forward. This person does not care, okay? It's in reverse. They do not care at all. This person's emotionless. They don't have feelings. They're driven by their lower extremities and money. They're all about what they can get. This person doesn't care. The person they want is this person and they're never getting her back this person knows they lost the best thing that ever happened to him spirit says and so they are they don't care anymore they don't care they're running around with diseases so you know 
And I guess if you want to have one with him, he has something that is not reversible, they're telling me. He has something that cannot be cured. Get the hell away from him. He's coming for you, sister. He's not going to give up. I was just told that you guys are going back and forth about breaking up, getting together. And, and he does it. Oh, should I stay? Should I go? Should I stay? Should I go? Tries to make you feel bad. It's called mind fuckery. You are way too smart, Aries, for this. Listen to me. You are way too smart. Might be a cancer, too, coming towards you. Yeah. Look at this prick. Look at him. He thinks he is Don Juan. He has all these people making sure that all of his needs are met and he doesn't do a damn thing. This is a pig. He's going down. I'm telling you right now. I know for a fact this person right here. What, what, what's fans only? Spirit, like fans only page? Yeah. This person sells themselves and does. He, he, I guess. I guess. He, I, Spirit says he puts a mask on when he's performing. Oh, I guess it's called sexual arts. They, these these sick and twisted mind fuckers, they call it the sexual arts. That's how they get away with pedophilia and harming and hurting people. Yeah. I hate this person. I'm sorry. I, I don't like this read. I want out of this energy so bad. This just makes me sick. There is, there's kids being hurt. There's, this is underage bullshit. And if you have underage kids, this is a predator in your own damn home. Oh, this is bugging me so bad. All right, this is why the big guns can't are being brought down. All right, now, now I know. Now I know why I was told to pull these. I only pull these angel cards when this is an emergency. This is an emergency. The Hierophant. Oh, Lord. Taurus energy. King of Pentacles. Okay. So the angels coming down. We're gonna they're gonna fight fire with fire. <coughs> so they're sending down Hazel, the merciful God, divine forgiveness, chain ob obtains friendship and favors of the great, secures promises. You're lucky. I just said they're sending the one the big guns down that fight with fire. These are way beyond the angels you guys have any idea or, or, or knowledge of. When these come down, shit gets real. We're, any tower you see on a card, you times that by a hundred, and that's the power of what these have. Woo! The devil. Oh, my God. Samuel, the severity of God. That's this angel. This seduction and downfall oh imagine that communicates with the dead teaches the occult and magic all right this person's a fake that's why they send this one down i heard clearing the way cutting the crap out don't lose faith i just heard be yourself there's a fake out here Big time fake. This, when this angel, when this one comes down, that means that there's a spiritualist out there, a religious person that is into using people and conning them for money. And this is like seances. This is like moon magic. You know, like having sacrifice. Oh, God. I don't even want to get into this. It just annoys me so bad. Sacrifices. So, like I said, if you have kids, protect them. God, you're more concerned about this dipshit. Okay, the moon, Gabriel. God is my strength. Divine revelation reveals messages has the power to destroy. They don't send these people down, sister, unless this is some serious shit. I don't know. Like, I feel like I'm screaming at you. Spirit says you don't want to listen. You think you got this all figured out. And apparently, whoever this friend of yours is, you're so damn jealous and envious of this person that you can't see the trees through the forest. And this person is going to take you down. God. You need to go watch my video of the Green-Eyed Monster. Get a grip. 
Maybe you need some counseling. I don't know. But this jealousy and envy and rage you got going on, Aries, this is eating you up. And you're going to... He knows this about you. He knows, you're, he knows you're jealous of this person. He knows you're envious of this person. He knows you're not this person. You can't come close because you're you. She is she. You really don't like your friend. You're a fake. Wow. I was giving you all these props. Hmm. Guess I'm not supposed to now. They're telling me no. No, no more props to you. You're not listening. You're not getting the message. <gasps> oh. I was just told. He's convinced you to be a part of the plan to hurt her now. Wow. She knows. She's gave you guys a ton of rope and you're going to be hanging yourselves from it here shortly. Eight of Wands. Vihu, the great and the exalted God. Grandeur makes one passionate towards God. All right. Remember me talking about messages and stuff? He's, th this is all about all this is going to end. All the messages, all the giant grandi grandiose, I'm hearing grandiose gestures, all of the lies, the manipulation, the promises that will never be kept, they're all getting exposed. All the, I just heard deleting, burning, getting rid of evidence, it's too late. They already know everything, so good luck. You're going to look worse now. Oh, my God. You're going to look worse now. What a dumbass move you guys made. Huh. You're looking way worse and way more guilty because of everything you've tried to get rid of because you don't think... Because you guys are so in your egos, you actually believe you're above the law. That's okay. That's why these guys are coming down. Because whenever your ego's that giant, this is the big guns. They get sent down. Michael and Metatron and God and Spirit, they send down the big gun, big guns. Okay, four pentacles. Misrael, God liberating the oppressed, self-anoint, cures mental illness, deliverance from persecution. All right, you got one sick son of a bitch here that is very, very, very mentally ill, and they're playing on you, and you are not picking up on it. All right, let's go for a few more minutes and I want to get out of this because this is making me sick. I'm just angry about this for you. you I, you're going to lose it all. Yeah, you're so busy trying to shaft your friend and screw her over because you're jealous for this hunk of shit. I like, get real. You're going to lose him in the end. And it's not even going to matter. <laughs> this is this is behind the scenes. Oh, yeah. Page of Wands in reverse. Yeah. See that? That's a sick dick. Didn't I say disease? I sure did. Oh, and we also have the angel that's coming down about disease, too. Cures illnesses and all kinds of stuff. So, hey. You didn't want to believe it. Just so you know, I heard he's purposely doing this to you. So, he purposely wanted to give you an STD. So, now... You're not going to have a sexual life with anybody because of this person. Wow. 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 This has been the hardest read. I'm sorry. Yeah. I don't want to listen, apparently. Okay. Two of Cups. <clears throat> Somebody's trying to manifest this back with you. Okay. I don't know if you guys are broke up. You're on one of your little, oh, runs away, comes back in a couple days after he goes and screws a couple more bitches. Spread some more STDs around. Yeah. And then he comes back to you and, oh, I'm so sorry. And you're like, oh, I want you back too. I love you. Please. You two deserve each other. Yeah. Cycle isn't over. You going backwards. You're going back. Oh, yeah. King of Wands now in reverse. This is a sick, disturbed, mentally ill person that plays off people's emotions. The only thing this person cares about is sex. This is oof, a manipulation. Look at that. No strength here. Nope, nope. This is a house hopper. 
This is a, yeah, there's the Queen of Pentacles again. Now she's in reverse. All right, tell us about this Queen of Pentacles. Oh, that, sh <laughs> she's been giving him his whole paycheck. And now, now she's broke. And now he's coming back to you to use you. Wow. <laughs> all the options are running out now. Yep, all those choices. Everybody's getting sick and nobody knows from who. Everybody's fighting amongst each other. Text. Oh, that's what those texts and all these messages are about. Everybody's trying to figure out because he's blaming all of you on each other. And it's him. He's the one spreading it. Oh, my God. And he's blaming all of you. Whoa. King of Swords in reverse. Is this another one of his boyfriends besides the King of Cups upright spirit? <laughs> yep it's him king of pentacles he's in reverse that's why it came up i said is this him spirit gives me his card i ask king of pentacles he comes up in reverse so he's out screwing a king of swords and a king of cups wow and you and a queen of pentacles <laughs> there's more there's pages here too yeah He's stuck, trying to rebuild. This is trying to come up with a new plan, a new scheme. It all has to do with money. Yeah, there will be no new beginnings. That's the sun, no new beginnings. Oh yeah, look at this. See that? Behind your back. Plans going, going south, Spirit says. Plans going south. King of Cups in reverse <laughs> Six son of a bitches here. Oh, boy. Wow. <laughs> That's all I can say. I hate these reads when they're like this, but... Oh, didn't I just say a page was going to come out? <laughs> in reverse. <laughs> this is underage. Yeah, that's underage. <laughs> He's screwing underage. That's a little boy, I was just told. Woo, sick son of a bitch, like I said, yeah. All right, you're going to come out of being stuck in your head, Aries. Yeah, you've been in a mental prison. You have not been happy because what you got yourself into. Oh, yeah, 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 there's a knight of pentacles here, too. It said underage boys. I, I, I can't go, I, no, I... This is, ooh, 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 yeah. Okay, we're going to get these other cards out. A few more questions and we're going to end this because I am, this is making me sick to my stomach. You know what you're with. You know what you got into because your friend told you. Your friend made this very clear to you, sweetheart, and you went ahead and did it anyways. Wow. This is, the, this is levels of desperation that you've reached now that there's no return back home, I heard. I heard legal, legal. Lawyer up. You're going to need a lawyer, honey. He is dragging you into everything he's going to go down for. And you may not even be a part of half of it. You're sure part of some of it. But he is dragging your ass down with him. Whoa. Yep, you're a sacrificial lamb, I just heard. Wow. Yep, you're blind. You do not want to look at the truth, and it is going to screw you like you've never been screwed before, I heard. Yeah, you think he screwed you? You wait. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Secrets are all coming out. See that? It's over. It's over. Been caught. Heard 20 years. I don't know what that 20 years is about. Oh, he's been doing this for like 20 years. That's all he knows. <laughs> He's going to try to come at you with a cup of love. This is the most immature energy ever. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He's going to cut. He, this person was wounded when they were a child. And they are mentally stuck at that age that I just heard incest happen to them. 
And therefore, when this person wants to manipulate somebody, they go childlike. I mean, they could even act like a baby. Like, mommy, take care of me. Oh, mommy, I'm so sorry I did that. Mommy, can I suck your boob? Can I suck your titty, mom? I mean, oh my God, this is gross. I hate this reading. Yuck, I don't even want to post this, but I have to because I've... I wonder why. This is why all that shit got deleted the first time around. This is disgusting. This is a disgusting human being. Ew. Ew. They act like a baby. They act like a baby. And and you're their you're being their mother. You're not being their girlfriend. You are being their mother. I'm so passionate about this because I don't want this to happen to you. Yeah, look, this is all this son of a bitch does. That's it. That's it. See all those people he parties with and buys him drinks? He doesn't buy his own drinks. This guy doesn't even wipe his own ass. Oh, wait. He doesn't even wipe his ass. No, he doesn't even wipe his ass when he takes his shit. He's so disgusting. Yeah. Page of Wands in reverse. Once again. Wow. I just keep hearing disease. Okay. There you are. And I'm ending this because I can't stand this anymore. It's making me sick. I'm getting angry because... You're not listening. You don't want to listen. And I, I guess why this is upsetting me so bad for you is because you were warned. Spirit said you were warned. You knew all about this guy. And you were doing this behind your friend's back with this guy. I heard even at her birthday party when she was asleep, you screwed him. Wow. <laughs> well, good luck with that. Ciao.